Hey, how are you? Come on in, welcome to my home. My name is Michael Paggi, and we're filming our show, Extraordinary Exotic Animals. Come on in and let me show you around of how I live. I live with a lot of exotic animals, including this little guy right here. This is a marmoset monkey. She's my favorite, favorite pet of all. This is my brother, Peter Paggi. Hi, how are you? Come on, baby. Let's see if she'll, let's see if she'll jump on me. She likes you better than me, that's it. Think? Come on, baby. She's a little scary cat, isn't she? All right, good girl, good girl, good girl. Good girl. You gonna jump over? Come on. Good girl. Come on. Go on, go on, go on. Come on. All right, now this is a marmoset monkey, and I bottle fed her and raised her from a baby. Stay with me. Alright. Come on, let's take a walk, guys. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, she's good. Come on. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna feed this monkey here. And this is a baby monkey of the one that you just saw. Is this the new baby? It's a new baby. Yep. Her name is Naughty. Okay. Oh, she's cute. Naughty Naughty is her name. She's not gonna bite me like the last one, is she? No, this one doesn't bite. This one okay. this one doesn't bite. This one's very tame. So we're gonna go ahead and bottle feed her real quick. Whoops, come on. Let's go. Oh, she's cute. She is cute. She's like a little termite. Now this is a special formula that I use. This formula has all kinds of super ingredients in it so that she grows up fast and healthy. Come on. And she likes to take this bottle usually about uh, probably three times a day. And once she's done, then she likes to sleep for most of the day. Kind of like you. <laughs> she eats a lot for a little one, doesn't she? Yeah, she does. She does eat a lot. Now these marmosets are kind of neat. They uh, usually have two babies at a time. And the babies grow up within about a year, they're able to have babies again. So as long as they're hand fed like this, we should be okay. Hi everyone. We're going to take some time out to relax for a few minutes. And what I want to do now is, I want to answer all of your questions. I'm sitting here with my pet baby marmoset monkey. Her name is Nadia. And what we're going to do is, just take some time to chill out, take our time and answer all of the questions as, why do I have all these crazy animals? How did I get all these crazy animals? And exactly how do I feed everything? And what exactly motivates me to want to have all these animals? One day, I might be coming to your house to ask you the same questions. So first off, let's go ahead and answer a few of the questions that are on your mind. Number one, where do I get all these animals? First of all, there's a unique set of people in this world that particularly breed and have exotic animals in their home. Now, it is perfectly legal to have these animals in your home and most people really enjoy having something extraordinary like the, the kind of animals that I have. A lot of animals that are born in captivity are almost always being bottle fed. A bottle fed animal is usually going to be very, very, very tame. For example, this particular baby here was bottle fed with this syringe and this syringe is filled with milk formula. So for example, she's hungry now, so we're gonna go ahead and give her a little taste. Now this monkey gets fed three or four times a day. And one of the things that I enjoy is that when you have an exotic animal like I do, they tend to bond on you. They tend to fall in love with you just like as if it's your own baby. And I like that. I want animals that I can keep, train, and love, and give back. Give back to nature and so on. So now, a couple of things that you were thinking is, how do, I, how do I feed all these animals? I mean, I've got several hundred animals here on my private zoo. Now, these several hundred animals all have special diets. A lot of them need grains and corn and things like that. Other animals are strictly meat eaters. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you outside here in a little while, and we're going to show you every single thing exactly how I do it all. And one of these days, I'm going to be coming around to your neighborhood, and hopefully, filming what, what you do and the animals that you love, just like this.